Oh, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope. Oh, look at the weather. Dry, sunny. Not a cloud in the sky. Not a cloud in the sky. Oh, absolutely beautiful. I think it's the first time we've had a morning like this this year. See, it's been raining, raining and raining all the time. I don't know. But looks like it's getting better. I really hope so. Because another thing, the poor old moles, they've had a rough time with all this water. The weather, with the water table being so high, they've had to be really busy digging, digging. Digging. Well, I'm digging. Yeah, there's been a big demand, big demand for uh, mole snortles because uh, they've had that much water in their uh, in their runs or tunnels or whatever you want to call them. They've, uh, they've been having to swim everywhere. Anyway. Uh, you know, I think uh, after this uh, nice weather here dries up a bit, I'll be able to get rid of the snortles and get back to uh, deep tunneling again. Oh, and uh, it seems the uh, the latest idea to solve the plastic waste problem is uh, to have refill stations for people with their own bottles to go. All right, if it was just water bottles, plastic bottles, what were, were all over everywhere. Fast food containers, everything. Beer cans, everything. Surely the thing what we need to do is to get people to recycle properly. They think recycling is you heat your fast food and you drink your bottle of whatever, squash or whatever you call it, orange juice, water. And then to recycle it, you just throw it out your car window. Onto the nearest verge. That's what the vast majority of people these days think recycling is. They had a bit of sense. And took it home. We put it in a bin. There'd be no problems about all this waste plastic. It's just selfishness. That's what we're doing, we're being selfish. We've got to learn not to just throw things here or there. Thank you.